Do you ever wonder which is cheaper, Walmart or Target? Well, in today's video, we're gonna answer that question for back to school supplies. I'm heading to both Target and Walmart and I'm price comparing some items so that you know where you can find the best deal. Hey you guys, it's Christina from the Purple Alphabet. Welcome to the channel. We are price comparing today. So I'm heading over to Target, I'm heading over to Walmart, and we are gonna see which is really cheaper. Is it Target or Walmart? What's your guess? Let me know down below. We got a lot to cover in this video, so hang on to your hats, grab that coffee, and let's go. Remember guys too, your prices might vary per store, so it just depends on where you're located. Let's start off first with glue sticks. I have the two pack of Elmer's School Glue here. It's 50 cents for the package at Walmart. Over at Target, we have the same package for 50 cents, and that means this one is a tie. I also wanted to point out some new finds in the Elmer glue just because I thought they were great. They have scented Elmer's glue sticks. I thought those are pretty interesting. They sell them in the giant packs here and also in the four packs. If you tried them, let me know down below what you think of them. Moving on to the six packs. Six packs at Walmart is $2.27 and over at Target. For the exact same package, you can get six Elmer's glue sticks for $2.29. So you guys, it looks like on this one, Walmart has definitely won out even though it was the same for the two pack. Also real quick to note is that I saw some signs in Walmart that said that they were two for a dollar. So that's a little, um, I don't know, what would you say, scammy in a way. So if if you want just one, get one, it's still gonna be 50 cents. All right, back over at Walmart, if you wanted to get the 12 pack of glue sticks, it's $3.92 over at Walmart. Same package, $3.99 at Target. Sorry, Target, I think Walmart is going to win the glue sticks overall. Good job, Walmart. So if you want some glue sticks, get them over there, unless you just want two, because it'll cost you exactly the same at either place. Also, if you wanted the three giant glue sticks at Walmart, it's $2.88 and $3.19. Ouch, over at Target for the exact same thing. Walmart has one even on the giant glue sticks, you guys. Let's go on to the glue bottles. If you want the Elmer's glue bottles, they are two for a dollar or I bet 50 cents. You can also find them at Dollar Tree for one dollar, which is not the best deal. Over at Target, the exact same size glue bottle can be found for 50 cents. So it looks like we have another tie between Walmart and Target for this glue size bottle. If you need a bigger glue size bottle, the large size, you can find it at Walmart for $1.44. Over at Target, the exact same size, the large one is $1.49. So once again, you are going to get a better deal at Walmart. However, they do have up and up brands like this one over here for 25 cents, if you don't mind the off brand, but good job, Walmart for winning this one. All right, let's move around the store now and we're gonna take a look at the colored pencils. Over at Walmart, a package of 24 Crayola colored pencils in the back to school section can be found for 97 cents. And be sure to make sure you're looking at the right labels too, you guys. Over at Target, the exact same Crayola colored pencil package of 12 is 99 cents. So just by a couple of pennies, Walmart's gonna win this one. If you really wanna save a couple of pennies, then Walmart's where you should get your 24 pack of colored pencils. Next up, we have the markers, Crayola 10 pack bold markers, 97 cents at Walmart. Also, I wanted to know that they had them in the fine tip as well for the exact same price for 97 cents for the bold color set of markers. It's a 10 pack. Now, if you head over to Target, you can find these exact same items just for a couple pennies more. Here are the thin ones at 99 cents, and then they also had the bold one, the broad tips for 99 cents as well. Walmart's gonna win this one to get your thin and bold markers in the classic color set. However, I need to give some special bonus props over to Target because they actually had the other colors, the bold and bright color scheme for 99 cents too. So if you want something different, get these at Target. Okay, now we have the crayons, a 24 pack of crayons from Crayola's 50 cents at Walmart. These are a dollar over at Dollar Tree, so don't get them there. Then over at Target, the exact same Crayola 24 crayon pack is... 50 cents. And so this is another tie. Also a big honorable mention over at Walmart, they had all those specialty crayons, the metallic, the neon. They are 24 packs for 2.97. You can get the, I think it's a 12 pack over at 
Dollar Tree for a dollar. And then we have the jumbo crayons here as well for just almost $3. And those are the really fat ones. Moving on to watercolors, we have the Crayola package of eight count watercolor paint. It's $1.97. I also wanted to point out that they did have the 16 count too. If you wanted more, that's $3.45. But we're only gonna compare the eight because that is what I found over at Target. So $1.97 here at Walmart for the eight count. And it's $1.99, this almost the exact same one over at Target just slightly different design same brand but same color count as well so Walmart has one for this on your watercolor paint or you can upgrade and go ahead and get the 16 count which is exactly what we did one of my favorite topics to talk about are pencil bags and pencil pouches and pencil boxes. Now we're gonna basically compare these boxes, uh, not these, these have a little um, special opening on the top, but these down here are just your basic ones. These are 97 cents and they come in a couple different colors. So we're gonna try and find something very equitable over at Target. But before I do that, I did wanna run through the selection that they have at Walmart. The selection at Walmart versus Target is very, very different. So they have quite quite the selection to choose from and you just kind of have to poke through and kind of see what you like. So I'm going to run the camera over some of these so you can get an idea of what they have at Walmart and all the different kinds of styles and the different sizes and the different color themes because you really need to see all the different ones they have. And of course, all of these are different price ranges too, just depending on what you want. So if you don't want that standard plastic case, then you'll definitely have to check these out. Here's a little bit of the pencil pouches, which fit inside a binder, and they're a little bit slimmer than having the pencil boxes. I know a lot of people prefer those. We use these pencil bags for our busy bags because they can fit some activities in here. Now I did find the plain pencil pouches, which are the ones we do use for busy bags. They are my ultimate favorite because they have the clear front and they have a zipper pouch and they have the holes to kind of bind them together. Those can be found, the plastic ones, for $0.48, cents, but if you prefer the ones that have the fabric on the back, which is what I do, those are $0.97. Cents. So we're going to look for similar ones of those at Target as well. The plain black boxes and the ones that have the clear front is what we're looking for to compare over at Target. So in Target, I found some very similar pencil boxes. They are $0.99. Cents. They look almost identical, so I would have to say that Walmart is going to take away the win on the plastic boxes but I do like some of the colors they have and just a quick glance over all of the bags that they have at Target once again there's such a variety here's those really simple plastic ones these tend to break so I'm not a big fan of these I do like the fabric ones a lot better they had a really pretty selection of them and they were all over a dollar so those are kind of fun to look at and then of course these right here would be great for busy bags because they're gonna hold up a lot better than just the plain plastic ones and then here's a couple more selections of the different sizes and styles that they had at Target. But all in all, Walmart, you're winning with your pencil pouches and with your bags. Definitely the better price and I actually really, really like the pouches a lot. And a little bonus mention for Target, look how cute these pencil pouches are. They actually look like pencils. They were kind of adorable, so I did have to show you those because, you know, that's what I do here over on the purple alphabet. Scissors are really hard to compare because they are just slightly different at each store for some reason. So I had a hard time. I went online and found these. They are going for $1.47 for the blunt tip and then $1.88 for the pointed tip. And these are the kids' children's safety scissors. So I was looking for these over at Target because I didn't see them at Walmart and they had all the same ones at Walmart just slightly more expensive but I was looking for those ones that I found online the ones that they are running promotions on just to see the price and I kind of had to skirt through all the ones here on top go through all the up and up brand ones and then finally down here at the bottom ah found them all right so here's the ones that I found online and they are running for a dollar 49 here compared to Walmart so it looks like Walmart is definitely going to win out just a little bit on the price here, just a couple of pennies. But you really do have to pick and find the one that you need because not all of them are on a bargain sale price right now. Next, let's go over to rulers. We have the wooden rulers here at Walmart for 25 cents. They also had some of those clear rulers and then they had the flexible rulers as well, but these were hard to compare to the ones at Target because they were all slightly different. But Target did have some similar ones, plus they had a ruler that folded out, which was pretty cool. But that's not what I'm looking for. I'm looking for those wooden rulers and I found them and they are 25 cents for the wooden rulers over at Target. So this one is a tie, unless you want one 
one of those specialty rulers. Next up, we have composition notebooks. So these are great. So there's a couple different brands here at Walmart. The pen and gear brand are 50 cents each. They also had a different style in them with that kind of fun cover on them that's kind of traditional. So they had lots of different colors over here. At Target, they had a rainbow of colors for 99 cents in the up and up brand. They all came in wide ruled and in college ruled, but I looked down further and they had a different brand that wasn't even up and up and this one was even cheaper this one was 50 cents so it looks like we have a tie for notebooks with Target and Walmart, the composition notebooks. But when we looked over at spiral notebooks, the one subject notebooks, I found two different styles. One was 94 cents. And then when I went around to the other side of the display, these were all 35 cents for the same type of notebook, the spiral bound. Over at Target, the same thing here. We have the spiral bound here for 99 cents. And I couldn't find any cheaper. If you've seen cheaper ones at Target, please do let me know down below in the comments because I'd like to know that as well. So it looks like I'm gonna have to give this win for price over to Walmart for their 35 cent notebooks. Let's take a look at some index cards. We have a hundred pack of index cards here and they have the lines on them. These are all 48 cents over at Walmart. For a similar package over at Target, the Up and Up brand, it is a hundred cards inside and they are all lined. These are 49 cents. Just one penny, you guys, just one penny cheaper over at Walmart. So I have to give it to Walmart on the win on that one. Walmart posted brand post-it notes are all a dollar and they had lots of different colors to choose from. I love the post-it notes. You can also find these over at Dollar Tree for a dollar right now. And then over at Target, the exact same post-it notes are a dollar. You guys are tying over here on the post-it notes. Then we have pens. Pens are so hard to compare because they are just slightly different at each store. So I chose the cheapest ones I could find that are name brand, which is the Bic at 97 cents and all the colors, the red, black, and in the blue over at Walmart. So I looked for something very similar over at Target and I did find the Bic brand, once again, 99 cents for the blue, red, or even the black colored pens. So just buy a couple of pennies, Walmart's gonna win this one, but it's only a couple of pennies. Dry erase markers are also a great buy right now. At Walmart, we have this package that has four plus a two count bonus for a total of six in the package for $4.46. I also wanted to note that you can get all kinds of different packages of dry erase markers in different sizes and different colors. We have an all black package for $4.46. This also comes with the bonus two markers, so there's six inside of there. And that's what we're gonna use in our price comparison. And they even have the thin ones too. Over at Target, I found the exact same thing, all kinds of different packages and different configurations and different colors, but I am looking for that smaller package that's on promotion right now. And I found a very similar one that looked just slightly different. This is bonus four plus one. So there's only five in here at 449. So because it comes with one marker less, Walmart is actually the better deal at 446 for this package. Erasers, we have the Papermate erasers. They come three to a pack over at Walmart. They're $1.34 and they also have the generic brand two for much cheaper at 47 cents if you prefer that. I just wanted to note that so that you knew that that was a different option that was a little bit cheaper. For the same erasers, the Papermate ones, three to pack, it's $1.39 over at Target. So that means Walmart is the winner at $1.34 for the exact same item. For the pencils, we are looking at the name brand Ticonderoga because those are just amazing pencils. For the name brand, we're at $3.97 for the 24 count package, which is what I'm gonna use in our price comparison. Over at Target, the exact same one is $3.99 for the 24 pack of pencils. So this is a case where Walmart wins. But I also wanted to note the different sizes that all of these come in, in case you needed more, in case you needed less. So you just have to go over to the pencil section we have some for $2.49 here for a little bit less. You can get the two pack of the fatter pencils when you're learning to write for $1.42. This one here is $48 inside for $9.47. Stock up on the pencils now because these are really great. Target also had some similar packaging. Here's the fatter pencils with the pencil sharpener for $2.89. You get four inside of those. And then they also had the colored ones that are really pretty and they're still name brand. So if you wanted to not have your traditional pencil, these would be the way to go. They also come 
from in neon and I saw the neon at Walmart too. Highlighters from Sharpie. We have the four pack over at Walmart for $2.54 and I thought I could find these on sale or a little bit cheaper, but I really, really couldn't. I tried. If you've seen them cheaper, let me know. You can also get them in the multicolored pack too. But get this, you guys, over at Target, we have the four pack for $1.99, same brand. This means Target actually won. I gotta put their logo in the middle of the screen now. I was actually very surprised. Folders, we have the five star folders over at Walmart for 97 cents. They come in the rainbow color. They have just pockets or just prongs. The pronged ones cost a little bit more, $1.47. And usually I can find the paper ones that are a little bit cheaper and I couldn't find them in my store So I actually went online to see if I was just missing them and I did find them online So you can get some cheaper paper folders at Walmart for just 15 cents, which is extraordinary Over at Target we had the five star folders for $1.29 So they cost a little bit more over at Target for the exact same brand. Once again, they had them in the rainbow colors, in prongs, and in folders. But if you wanted to get the Up and Up brand, they had them for 50 cents each, not quite that 15 cents that you see over at Walmart. So really the best deal on the folders is going to be at Walmart for basically the same thing, just a different label on the packaging. I also wanted to mention the dividers. We have the Avery brand of dividers. You can also find these at Dollar Tree right now for a dollar. And then they have the generic ones and various different price points depending on what type of dividers you wanted. Generally speaking, Walmart was cheaper on, on these. Target does have the Up and Up brand. I had a hard time finding Avery over at Target, but I did find a great selection of dividers. Once again, all various prices depending on what you want. If you wanted the bargain though, definitely get the Avery brand either at Dollar Tree or over at Walmart. We also have binders and we're going to compare the one inch binders because that seems the most equitable and both of them were that generic brand, the Walmart brand and the Target brand and they all had rainbows of color so you can get any color that you want. At Walmart they were $2.47 and then over at Target for a comparable binder they had the rainbow colors too. These were all $3.49. So of course, Walmart has won as they have won most of the things in this video, I think except for one and then some ties and some others. If you like this video, I'm gonna put another one up here on screen that I think you're really gonna like. I'll see you over there. Make sure to click subscribe to see more videos like this. Give me a thumbs up to show your love.